38, 37. Nice out in the open and sunny if that's what you're looking for. Camp post right here. Looks like five. Narrow sight and very slopey on both sides. It's down in. Seven. Eight. That's 52 and 91, 90 is on this side. And again, I don't understand why they have some of the connections on opposite sides. But it's 55, 56. Eighty six and eighty fives on that side. Toilet over here. And eighty three, which I wouldn't wish it on anybody. So sixty nine looks pretty good. Not anybody real close. Sixty eight. And start getting pretty close up here. Sixty seven. Sixty six. Okay, so 76 has lots of construction going on through in this section. <laughs> Lot 75 and 74. And the problem with 71 is that the hookup are drawn on the other opposite side. Same with 72. They're pretty flat on top of each other. So all these sites over here, starting with 107, are non-electric, non-hookup sites. 108, all the way up here on the right-hand side. Starting at 115 right here. It's an electric hookup. 116. Got it on the passenger side. And then back here at 124, it switches to the right side. Of course, right by my standards. got construction up through here. Lots of things of construction. One twenty four. One twenty five. Other side of the road don't look too bad. That's all construction over in the middle right now. Lot fifteen. Lot fourteen. 
they got little red flags everywhere, so I don't know what they're running, but they're putting all kinds of stuff in. They want a deer right between this. Really? Across the road. There's a lot in here. This is one of the bathhouses back in here, so lot 30. come back into here again. Fifty, forty-nine on this side, ninety-three, ninety-four. Five. Okay, this is where it starts the full hookup section. Pads. They've added extra concrete to the pads up here, so you got more room. Everywhere else in the park, it's an eight-foot wide pad, very narrow. One hundred, and then over here on this side are numbers forty-four. One hundred two is on the opposite side over there, but the concrete pads are much wider here. If they're not a new pad, then they've added to the existing pad, so there's more room. Very much out in the open, very little shade, but nice flat pads. Okay, so lots of sun out here. 128. Over here, you got a little more shade, but okay. So this is starting the 200s, 203, 234 on the other side. Again, we're back to the narrow spots. Electric hookup only. Um, Actually, it looks like it floods back there pretty good. It's flooded right now. 208. to the water. Sites aren't sloped too bad. Looks like it'd be pretty easy to level. These are the ones that are right up here by the lakeside. 214. And then they got a couple yurts up here too. There's 215. Those are yurts. Two nineteen be awesome. It's a little stop, but two nineteen, two twenty. Those both have the hookups on the passenger side again. Actually, all these do. Two twenty one, two twenty two. Six. 
129. Okay, and then we're going to go to section row D, sites 128 through 168, 145, and then we're on this side of the road. Over here is 147. Forty-three, one forty-two, one forty-nine, one fifty, one forty-one's over there. A lot more shade, which means a lot more mud. section over here a couple of them without any hookup no power over here is 153 it's camp host one's in the middle you got a lot of room but you're uh you're in the trees and the mud so. 155 doesn't look bad it's all by itself Same thing with 156, although it's pretty wet. <laughs> Got a bunch of straw in there to cover the mud. with 134, 33 over here. Sorry I'm shooting through the truck, but I don't know how else to do this. 162. 63. Ended up. Sites 169 and 184 up road E here. One eighty three and one eighty two with one seventy on this side. Seventy eight's a nice big spot by itself over here. Looks pretty level. And 176 has it on the passenger side again. 